All right, ladies and gents, let's play Slay the Spire. Let's have a nice, easy, ironclad game. Greetings. All right, let's see. Curse for a hundred gold or two hundred and fifty gold. Let's see. Uh, we can buy off the curse here if we want to, or even here, and that really doesn't cost us much, especially because I would want to go up the similar path anyway. So sure, let's just take the curse. Sure. All right. One for you, two for you, one for you. Now, why did we take the money? We took the money because we might be able to buy a relic with it. And I would absolutely take a relic for a curse. If you've never seen Slay the Spire, I welcome you to stick around and experience the Spire. And I can explain as well. Hmm, these are good. But I think Battle Trance is the safest. So let's Battle Trance. Alright. Of course. Of course I would not get any defensive cards. So alright. Heal for six at the end of this fight. Alright, well, let's Battle Trance. Excellent. Bash him again. And strike him again. I like it. That means next turn we can do a lot of damage to him. We might have lethal, but we probably won't. We would need three strikes. Oh, yeah, we got it. One, a two, a three. And we heal back up to full. Iron Wave is the greatest. All right, let's visit his shop. Drop here. Drop this injury out of our deck. No need to have that. All right, we could pick this up, but or alternatively, we could not ever do that again. Let's see, uh, letter opener is kind of bad for us because I was going to go aggressive. Happy flower kind of doesn't do anything, so I guess we'll pick up a happy flower. The reason I would pick it up if it doesn't really do anything is just occasionally it will give us a benefit. You know, kind of just sometimes it'll help, sort of. All right, let's go. I need you to die, definitely. Let's set this up here. Let's see, you're only dealing five, so I can go like this. Perfect. So, we prepped him to die. Good. Uh, we've also kind of prepped him to die if we get bash. If we don't, then we need two strikes, which is also quite likely. Oh, I also forgot. I also have uh, a card that draws cards, so good. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Why? Because I've never made the dropkick run really work, and I'd love to. Hold on. Hold on a second. When's our next shop? You know what? Let's gamble. I'm going to gamble hard. Is that a good idea? No. But do I want to? Oh, yes. All right, bash. Why did I upgrade bash? Because I'm going to try and make this whole bash run go. All right, cool. Bash. And Iron Wave. And this. Yeah. Well, we, we still took damage, but whatever. All right, cool. Attack him. Do a smidgen of blocking. We'll do a smidgen of blocking. Only a smidgen. Why only a smidgen? Because I want to go fast. All right, good. Now, uh... Drawing is a very big risk because we can get some bad cards. Oh, yes. We could also get some good cards. In case you're wondering what I meant by that, I could get my curse. And for my curse, I take damage for each card in my hand at the end of uh, each round, which is how you say a bad. All right. So we go like this. We go like this. Go like this. And sure, why not? We only lose the one. Nice. Now, next turn, because he's still vulnerable, we're just going to try and hack him to pieces. Okay, drop kick, yeah, because that's free. Yes! Get Shrek'd, sire. That's a nice... Ooh. Yeah, 
I don't know. I kind of am going for a different build pass. Let's just pass on that. We actually did pretty well there. We did take 20 damage, but that's okay. Okay, cool. This is free. Nice. All right, this is also good. Let's see. It's better for me to play out multiple cards so that we take less damage. Yes, yes. More. Beat him down. Alright, yeah. I love it. I don't care. I love it. Oh, they're both attacking me. What a pain in the butt. Alright, I can deal 10 to one of them. Okay. That's free. Oh, that's, that's interesting. Sure. Alright, we still take 5, which is unfortunate, but... He's okay. We have plenty of relics to help us out here. Oh, that's... That is a bad, bad hand. I will take the two, because no choice. Now all we gotta do is beat seven out of this guy. One for you, and two for you. Um... Hmm... Sure, we'll, we'll pick up the Berserk. Uh, I'd rather go towards more question mark land, I think. So let's do that. Amamori. Amamori, you're a bit late, but thank you. You. I will destroy you. Someday. I would like to hit you more, but I'd rather block more. So. I will destroy you soon. If we manage to live, which is is an if, it's a pretty big if, in fact, um, we will be in a pretty decent spot because of Amamori. Because we can pick up more cursed items and whatnot. Oh yeah, these. Uh, ooh, these. How about these? Give me my money back. Uh, Searing Blow. That's a good backup plan. Okay, let's see here. Oh, yeah. Are you kidding me? Sure, I'll take the damage for upgrades. Upgrades are much harder to find. Remove all curses. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Free curse removal, dudes. Okay, so first off... um, Since we can't outdo these guys, I think I'll just do this. Because it makes this fight super simple. Cool. We even got a potion back. That's fantastic. Alright, go to another query. No! I saved the potion for this fight! Alright, let's see. This does 9. This will do 8. No, this does 7. Okay. So, who do we kill? This guy? Yeah. Because we can go like this and like this. Then we defend. Oh my god. Man, that's sweet. That free curse removal is exactly what the doctor ordered. Now, to be fair, we are in trouble. Because these guys can deal a kind of obscene amount of damage for being tiny slimes. <coughs> Alright, let's see here. Now I can strike, strike to kill the dude way in the back. Very carefully, might I add. Um, then I think I will go with defend and do, oh, sure. We'll slap that on. Happy flower did its duty. Hit duty. All right. Goal is to try and kill this dude. We cannot. We still cannot unless we do too much. So, I could do three cards to deal with him. Yeah, that's fine. And now we just defend. Because that means we don't take any damage. And that's fine. And these guys are going to go in sequence. One of them will weaken us, and the other one will attack each time. Because that's what they do every single time. Hey, look, blood for blood. Goodbye. Hey, Bash. I hope I get more of those... Uh, Oh, what are they called here? Hold on. I'm going to draw it in a second. 
I hope I get more drop kicks. That'd be awesome. So, we are. Oof. Thunderclap, huh? Nah. Alright, so we're gonna take a big risk because I don't have a lot of time. Our big risk is instead of upgrade or instead of healing, we're gonna start upgrading our cards. Because I'm gonna upgrade Searing Blow. Now, why is this such a big risk? Because I'm at half health. And against this dude, that can be real bad. So, bash ya. And iron wave ya. And we're gonna drink this, because it will become necessary in a second. So, he's gonna make us draw one less card. But because I had this artifact, we get to just remove the debuff. Okay. So, setting this up is good. Setting this up is good. And more of these. Why? Because we really would like to get him to 70. We're not going to, but we would really prefer it. Alright, this first. Alright, let's see here. Can I get him there? Yes, I can. We're even going to drink this potion now, because I can go... Uh, the Searing Blow is actually worth more, because he's going to remove the debuff. Oh, yes! What we've done is we've actually sapped him to the point where his little dudes here only have 30 health. Only because that's not really that low. Or, uh, that's, that's pretty low considering the normal. Let's see. That's not worth playing. This is. So what do we do? I think we go one of these for you. One of those for you. And Searing Blow. Bam! Now we get debuffed by this guy. But that is okay. Because the other guy's entirely dead instead of splitting. Because he would normally split again. There we go. Now his little dudes will only have seven. Is that to the power of our upgrades? Maybe. Maybe not. Now we could take 20, but I would prefer not to. So instead, we'll just do this. Nice! Well, that wasn't really a good turn, because if we had more attacks, we would have just killed him. But at that, you know, who cares? Yeah! Nice. Oh! Demon form or reaper. I love demon form so much, but Reaper will heal us. Not demon form. I can't. I can't help it. Um, this is the best choice, but I'm going Calling Bell. Because we literally just get to have one curse, and it's the least bad curse. Because <coughs> it just evaporates at the end of every, or at the beginning of every fight. Alright, let's see. I like the idea of going to as many fires as possible for upgrades. So, one, two, on this route, and then we'd have to fight, and then three as an intermediate. Or we can go through question mark land here, and get one less, but go to a shop, and dodge all the mini bosses. So we're going to go right. The reason we're going to go right, because I don't think I can beat one of them mini bosses. Gosh darn it. This would be a great time to have many things in my hand, which I do not have. I will take 10 damage. Fight me. Why did I take 10 there? Well, I now have a power that gains me 2 strength every turn, which is magnificent. Alright, let's see here. So... Yeah, I think we'll do this, and also that, and also some of this, and we'll block. Uh, sure, I'll prevent some damage on me. You're gonna live a while. Nice. Nice. You have one health, so I'm pretty sure I can kill you. Now, let's see. Let's draw a card. Nice. Uh... It's actually worth more for me to just defend, defend, and then smackify you a bit. Yes, yes, it's coming together. Taking a little bit of damage, but that's okay. Mm-hmm. 
I'm going to set this up. And we're going to begin knocking at this dude. I could have knocked him down. But I chose to upgrade the power. Was that a bad idea? Almost certainly, yes. Whew. So first off, let's see here. 25 is only 12. Okay. Well, let's see what our hand looks like here. Okay. Mbasha. Dropkick for free. That's good. Uh, Iron Wave. That's also good. And we'll strike you. So now we take no damage. Also, we're very strong. Yes. With ease. We'll shrug a little bit. Hmm. I don't normally take that, so I think I will. So. Okay, just bet the one where we usually win. Okay, cool. Whatever. He took our money. I'm mad, but whatever. Oh, demon form. There's no sense playing that, because we already had Clumsy. Now, why did we want Demon Form in our hand to start? Oh, boy. Because now, we will do these. And then we do the thing where we punch him in the face. Now, he's going to debuff us. This is bad. On the upside, he is weakened. Fight. Me. Now, we're putting garbage in our deck. Is this bad? Yes. I wanted to print a little bit of damage, though. Oh, yes. Because I'm hoping to do something like this. Bye-bye! Dropkick. Alright. This way. Now, I also could have picked up something else. What? I don't know. I like that one. Um... Let's see. There's a couple of good options here. I like this because it synergizes with our deck and we'll do this because upgrading our defense is actually not bad. <clears throat> the rest of this is garbage. Like, this is okay. But I think I'd rather just leave our deck the way it is. And then we're going to go up through here and up here. So, let's go. I hate you, Sneko. Oh, yes. This gets me this for free, and then I can smack you for free. Why did I want that right away? Because I hate Sneko with a burning passion. Oh, this is why. Right. One of those. One of those. One of these. Sneko randomizes the costs of your cards when you draw them. Sometimes, that's great. Sometimes, it's awful. So, yeah, I guess we just defend. No, not good. Alright, let's see here. First off, drop kick, because that's free. Uh, drop kick is still worth it, because it returns a mana. Let's do these. Or play point, I suppose I should have said. Yeah, get dead. Ah, uh, sure, I'll pick this up, because I think it's cool. All right, here. We're not going to... Ooh, we could dig up a relic. We could dig up a relic. I think the safer path would just be to upgrade um, my Searing Blow. But, yeah, no, we'll do this. The relics that I can get are not that good. <laughs> Not right now, anyway. Oh, sure. See, there you go. Matryoshka. So, at a chest, we get double the relics. This truly is the relic. The most relic relic that has ever relicked. Oh, but we only have three. Alright, we're doing that. Why? Again, upgrade strength every turn. More strength. You can only buy the potion of strength. Hmm.
it is unlikely we can kill this man before the healer heals him. However, we will try. Hmm. Nice. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Get out of my sight. Hey, healer. Hey, healer. G guess what? Your dude is gone. Did, did you know that your dude is gone? Bye. Hmm. Nah, I don't really want any of these. Like, Inflame is nice, but I have Demon Form. Alright, Matryoshka. Cool. More things that we can do at fires. I hate you. Alright, we gotta be very careful here. I think this is the play. The unfortunate thing is we did not get demon form. And on the turn that we kind of needed it. Alright, let's see here. I could just try to bash him out. Because I can go bash and uh, searing blow. And just hope that we draw something worthwhile. Nah. There we go. Now we still take some heavy hits. But the good news is... Now we have demon form. Okay. Let's see. This does 27. This would do 18. That's not enough to kill you. So let's block, block, and then deal you some damage. I will take the three, because I got to hit you pretty hard. You are still vulnerable, which is good. Yes. One of those, and one of these. Blood for blood. Why blood for blood? Because blood for blood is often free. This is unfortunate. Alright, let's try and draw a card before we do anything else. We're going to hit you. Yes! That's how we do it. Demon form opening hand, boys. Demon form opening hand. Repeat the chorus. Alright, let's see here. This will, in fact, kill you. So, I should have armamented first. This is true. But I did not. I will not play that now. <coughs> oh well. Alright, come on, gents. Alright, let's see. Shockwave's pretty good right now. And we'll hit you. Why? Because while we are going to take some damage, I would also like very much to kill them. And we're only going to take more damage as time goes on. Alright, yep. Good. Uh, good. Very good. No damage, but unfortunately, he's going to be very strong very soon. And we were supposed to be the strong ones. So, first off, a little bit of that. Uh, how about some of this? Oh, good. Oh, yes. Uh, sure. We're getting a little heavy on attacks, but this is okay. We can, we can deal, yes. Okay, that's unfortunate for me. And, uh, yes. So, at least, we have the benefit of knowing that they are weakened and vulnerable for a very long time. As are we. <laughs> Alright, let's see here. I didn't get it. Okay. Uh, one of those... Defending for four? Nah. We're just gonna hit him hard. 
No defense. Offense. Much offense equals good, yes. Alright, well, let's cycle for free. Good. Battle. Oh, that's fun. But unfortunately, the time for it has passed. And the reason the time for it has passed? Did you not see what we just did to this man's face? Okay. Still free. Cool. One of those. Good. All right, we're done. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll shrug a little bit. It's probably a good idea. All right. Wow, look at all that. We're still smithing, though, because Searing Blow is the easiest way to win this. You just upgrade Searing Blow until it's nasty, dog. Next time, we're going to have to heal, though. Oh, we can't. I want it. I did it anyway. You're not my mom. You can't tell me what to do. <laughs> so you're saying your mom can tell you what tell me what to do? Yes, definitely. Um, armaments. Yep. So we live, but not by much. But we have our aggro tools ready. Ow. Alright, here's how we go. So first off, headbutt you. What do we need? We actually require Iron Wave. Blocking is good, not dying is good. Alright. Oh, we got eight health left. We may have ridden a little too close to the fire here. Alright, we have ridden too close to the fire, I believe. Okay, let's see here. Uh, deal 30 damage to him. 30? 40? 50? Oh, good. Oh, phew. Oh, at least we got that. At least we got that. Woof. How about resting? Resting sounds good. Alright, we're at half health. Alright. Immediately drink the potion. Immediately drink the potion. Drop kick him. Alright, sure. We'll, we'll post that up too. Yeah. Alright. So, that was not a good start. What were we looking for? Of course, Demon Form. We can now no longer play Demon Form. We basically can't play it anymore. Why can't we play it anymore? Well, it has to do with the fact that if we play it, we will probably die. So, let's take care of you. Again, we know we're taking some hits, but we just had to, like, go. Roll through some damage. We prevent some damage le next turn, which lets us do some stuffs. Um, I'll shockwave just to prevent some damage. Deals 28. That's unfortunate for me. Well, let's go. That was unfortunate. I will do this as well. Why? Because he's probably going to resummon the dudes, but I was hoping he wouldn't. Darn. Alright, let's see here. Battle trance. Demon form. It is worth it. Alright, um, what do we want in our hand? I don't know. I don't know what I pulled back. All I know is that he's going to weaken us a whole bunch, but we do have Demon Form. So, here's praying that we manage to live through the next couple of turns. Oh boy. Oh, that's not good. Uh, that's, that's very bad. Um, is there anything we can do about this? No? I can kill him, but we still die? Yeah, we still die, though. Oof. Oh, re yes! Regeneration is nice. So we get five health. We have five health at the end of this. I know I would have lived with two, but 
At least we have five. Oh my god, he's attacking again. But why? But why though? But why are you attacking again? Well, this is truly unfortunate. Oh well. Okay, that was unfortunate for me. I can't survive his attack anyway, so let's just hit him a bunch. Alright, well, we rode a little too close to the fire. Ow. Well, at least it wasn't boring. 